guys, I just wanted to do a really quick video. Um, a lot of you have asked me to do um, some outfits of the day, so I thought this would be a really appropriate time to do it because I actually wanted to say one thing, and that was um, thank you to all my new subscribers. Um, I think I have quite a few people um, subscribing from Prissy's channel. Um, she recently um, mentioned my name in one of her videos. A few days ago and she said very nice things about me and I really appreciate it um, Prissy thank you um, and also Melly loves Mac um, also mentioned me in one of her videos and I think I have some subscribers from her channel as well and they've said really some nice things um, so I really really thank you. sincerely thank you um, for saying so many nice things um, and thank you again to all my new subscribers thank you for taking the time to watch my videos um, I didn't think that really anybody would subscribe. I don't know why, but I just, I don't know. I, I really appreciate you guys stopping by and watching my videos and leaving comments. And I really appreciate the really nice comments that you guys leave. I'm just going to do a quick um, face of the day and outfit of the day. I'm just going to go and say what I have on my face. So today I'm actually wearing my um, Makeup Forever HD foundation, which is actually not a great color for me. I got it, I have it in 125, and it's actually a cooler tone foundation, but I'm just trying to use it up. It's already almost two years old and it needs to go. So this actually says it's good for 12 months. I don't, I don't it doesn't smell bad and blends out pretty well. It is, it's a, I don't know. I. I try to make it work. I think it works okay for now, but I'm not a big fan of this. It doesn't last on my skin. Although I have found that when I use this with primers, it doesn't last as well on my skin. And I used it one day without a primer by mistake because I was such in a hurry that I put it on without it and I noticed that it lasted on my skin a lot longer. So using it today without a primer and that lasts really well than with a primer. Um, and then, so I'm wearing this on my face, a um, blush, <laughs> I am wearing um, NYX Bourjois, Bourjois Pig, and I love this blush, that's what that looks like. I put it a little, little more on my cheek because it was a kind of um, blended out too much and you really wouldn't be able to see it, so I did put a little bit more. Um, on my lips, I actually have this e.l.f. matte lip color in Natural. I saw Bum the Bombshell Suite talk about this um, in one of her videos not that long ago. That's the swatch for that one. Such a beautiful, like, neutral, natural, pinky color. And then I layered on top of it um, Revlon's Just, Physical, Just Kissable Balm Stain in Smitten. And these usually, um, I tend to use these more. That's Smitten right there. I tend to use these more in the spring and summer because it can be a little bit drying, but I love this color. And I use it on its own too, and it works really well. Um, let's see. As a bronzer, I am using Laura Laura Mercier's Ritual, and I haven't hauled this yet, but that's what that looks like. Beautiful. I love this bronzer. I've actually, I really, when it comes to using my makeup, I have like ADD, and I have to use something like every different every day. I've been sticking to this bronzer every day for like the past two weeks since I got it. Um, let's see, highlight, I believe I used my Hard Candy Tiki, and my lid is broken, but that's what that looks like. This is a beautiful, beautiful highlighter. I'm sure a lot of you know what that looks like already. So then on my eyes, I did just kind of went simple, pretty simple. I just used my boudoir, um, my Too Faced boudoir eyes, and basically what I did, I used my Soft Ochre paint pot, and then I used, um, Fashion, oops. I used fashion on the inner half of my lid, used fuzzy handcuffs in the crease, and I used sugar walls on the outside part of my lid, and then I darkened up the outer V slightly with Voulez-vous. Such a gorgeous color, this color, oh my gosh. And then I think on the bottom lash line, I used sugar walls as well as Voulez-vous on the outer part. And then something different that I did do today was that I, I used a little bit of the Voulez-vous with a liner um, liner brush and slightly darkened up my upper lash line but then I tight lined um, with my um, with my Rimmel Scandalize eyeliner in black 
and surprisingly it's actually still there because when I, I find when, like when I use them on my bottom lash line they stick to my contacts and it's it rubs off on them and then I get blurry and I can't see so I'm not a huge fan of wearing things on my waterline only because I can't get anything to stick there and not mess up my contact lenses um, so if you guys have any suggestions as to what would work let me know I've been using this every day for like the past week it's the L'Oreal voluminous full definition I love this I um, my holy grail is lash blast and I've been reaching for this like over and over and over it gives such a nice effect and this is an older tube I got this initially when uh, make it by Tiffany talked about it and how she loved it and I said great let me try it because I know she loves the lash blast so I tried it. I thought she would I would like it too Initially, I wasn't that impressed with it. I let it, I let it kind of sit there for a while, and I am in love. I'm definitely repurchasing this, so this is going to go in my Holy Grail Mascara Trio. So from my, my Holy Grail Mascaras right now are this one, um, CoverGirl Lash Blast, and Maybelline Falsies. All right, outfit of the day. Okay, so I don't know how well you guys can see. I'm going to have to be cut off a little bit here. So I'm basically wearing just this shirt. It's kind of... Um, a little bit of see-through so I did wear kind of like a cami under this because I don't for the office or where I work I don't want to be showing my bra and even though it's like gray or whatever um, so yeah I'm wearing this and I got this at Marshall's um, probably two or three years ago it's kind of like very girly top very springy because it's very um, sheer and it's um, light so it's about 70 degrees today and I'm not sweaty with this on and then the skirt that I'm wearing, it's probably goes right up to, I don't know if you can see my knees, but it goes up to down to my, my knees. Um, and it has a stripe, it's actually from Old Navy. And this is definitely like an older skirt. I've had this for a few years now, and that's what that looks like. <laughs> and then for shoes, I am wearing these wedges. And these I got at Marshalls a few years ago, probably about three, three years now these have lasted me really well they are by they are by the brand bandolino i really don't that's what they look like they're really really cute they're kind of beat up but i mean usually in the summer and the spring i kind of wear these quite a bit so they're really really cute i love so, um i just wanted to hop on here and um do a quick outfit of the day i know some of you have been requesting that and i can try to do them and be like in the middle of the day um during lunchtime on some days if i feel like i have something outfit of the day worthy <laughs> and then um i also wanted to stop by and say thank you to all my new subscribers and again thank you for watching and leaving such nice comments and if you have any requests or anything, let me know. Um, I know some of you have asked me to do some eyeshadow, some eye looks. Um, I think in the past few videos or in the videos that I have from the, you know, the past few ones, um, I haven't written down what I have on my eyes. A lot of you have really liked the eye look, so I'm going to have to start writing down what I'm wearing when I do a video because that way I can tell you what I'm wearing. And if you want to see an eye look, then you can let me know and I can try to put something together whether a get ready with me or attempt a tutorial, <laughs> which is, sounds kind of scary to me. But anyhow, again, thank you so much for watching, um, and I will talk to you in my next video. Bye.